Hello crafty friends, it's Alicia of the Call Me Crafty Al YouTube channel and in today's video I'm going to be telling you how you could submit your entries for my 10k subscriber giveaway and give you an update on where I've been. I hope you'll stick around and find out more. Thank you so much for stopping by today. If this is your first time to my channel and you would like to enter my giveaway, I hope that you'll consider clicking on that subscribe button below and maybe even tap on that bell for notifications. If you're already a subscriber and regular viewer, welcome back. I'm so glad that you're here again. At the end of April, I came by and announced that I was going to have a big giveaway in honor of my 10,000th subscriber. And I am so excited to announce that as of this morning, I just hit 11,000 subscribers. Thank you so much to all of you who take the time to watch my videos, subscribe, hit the like button, and comment. Without you, I would not even be at 10,000 today or doing this giveaway. Before I get into how you're going to submit your entries, I thought that I would give you a little update on where I've been. I have had a few of you reach out to me in comments and via emails to check on me, and I so appreciate it. I am doing fine. My family's fine. It's just life has gotten a little crazy. If you get my notifications or maybe if you follow me and you get your notifications on your phone, you might have seen my community post recently about some new family members. If you didn't see that post on my community tab, we have adopted a couple new furry family members. Here on screen is a picture of our Linden and Aspen right after we brought them home. The first weekend in May, my husband and I were talking to my daughter about a pet and he actually said, I would rather you get a cat. And if you know my husband, you know that he had to have been losing his mind because he said we would never have pets. And especially since he was allergic to dogs, we couldn't ever get a dog. My daughter has wanted a cat for years and years. So we kind of looked at each other when she said that and we're like, did he really just say that? Is he joking? Well, long story short, he wasn't joking and he actually thought we should probably get a couple kittens so that they would have a playmate. So that is how we got Linden and Aspen. And let me tell you, the whole family is in love with these little girls. And unfortunately, we found out my husband is also allergic to cats. Um, so he's been trying to take some Zyrtec for that. And we're just making sure, you know, to keep the fan going in the house and the cats can't go in our bedroom. And he can at least still breathe. Whereas with dogs, he has a hard time breathing. So that's where I've been. We were either getting ready and kitten proofing the house or we were picking these kittens up and just trying to keep them alive because we are really, really green when it comes to pet ownership. And now that we've gotten that out of the way, let's get to what you really came for, how you're going to submit all of those secret words that you've been gathering over the last few weeks. Now, if you haven't heard about my giveaway and you are interested in still entering, there is time you have until the end of the month. I will have the video linked below that gives you all of the details on the secret words that you need to collect and even about some bonus entry opportunities. Now, unfortunately, the bonus entries, they're pretty much closed, except I do have one more to talk about toward the end of this video. So make sure that you keep listening to find out how you could get one final bonus entry. I have created a Google Forms and linked it in the description box below. To submit your secret words, along with any bonus entries you have and some information like your YouTube account name and your first name and email address, you'll want to click on that link below, go through each of the sections, and then submit that form. Now, if you find that you cannot do the Google form, which I would prefer that you do this because it's much easier for me to collect this way. But if you cannot do this, you do have an option to send me an email. I'm going to talk about that in just a minute. But 
if you do submit your entries using this Google form, I will give you one bonus entry into the giveaway. Currently, there are 15 secret words and with the bonus entry opportunities, you have over 20 chances for entries into this giveaway. To show you how easy the Google form is to fill out and submit, I'm going to do one on screen for you really quickly. Once you click on the link in the description box below, it's gonna bring you to a page that looks like this. You'll just want to go through and answer each of the questions. All of the questions in this first section are required. So you need to give me your YouTube account name and that would be the name that shows up when you leave a comment. Everybody who leaves a comment on here and if you're a subscriber has a YouTube account name. So for me, I would type in call me crafty Al on this line. Next, I will need your first name. Here, I would just type in Alicia. Third, I need an email address. Now you will want this to be an email address that you check frequently and that is not made for junk mail or something. This will be the email address that I send the online gift card to. So again, make sure that this is a valid email address. And just a heads up, even though I'm having you put in an email address, you do still have to officially claim your prize once I have announced it. But I will give more details on deadlines and how to claim it later on in this video. The next thing I would like you to answer is your country of residence. Like I mentioned in the original giveaway video, this is open to US and international subscribers. And then finally in this section, I want you to let me know where you would like your online gift card to. Like I mentioned again in the original video, it could be an online crafty retailer, an online general retailer. I just won't do ones to places like AliExpress or Wish. Now, you are not either committed to this. If you change your mind later, you can do that too. This just gives me kind of an idea beforehand. Then you're gonna click next and go on to the next section. This section is where you're gonna be putting in all of those secret words that you have been collecting over the past month or so. Now, just so you know, you do not have to put these words in any order. And I want you, if you only know five words, do them in secret word number one through number five. Don't worry that you got one word from video number one and one word from video number six. Just please go straight down one through five. And just so you know, January through May are not any of the secret words. So you'll fill out as many of those as you have and click next to go on to the next section. This is where you're going to remind me about any bonus entries that you earned. Just a heads up that I will make sure to validate or verify that all of the requirements and deadlines were met for you to actually get these bonus entries. And it's not showing on screen, but I do now have one about submitting your entries via the Google form. So there are actually five check marks on the final real form. Once you have checked any applicable bonus entries, you're gonna click on submit. This is a very important step. Do not forget to actually submit your entries. I will then receive an email that has all of your answers and then I will compile these for the final giveaway. Once you have submitted that, you'll get a message that your response has been recorded and then you'll see where it says submit another response. Please do not submit another response. I will only accept the first one for your YouTube account name and your first name. I hope that little demonstration showed you how easy it can be to submit your responses via Google. I hope that many of you take advantage of that bonus entry opportunity. Now, like I said before, if you absolutely cannot fill out the form, I do have a way for you to email me all of the things that I just showed you in the form. In the description box below this video, I have a little section that you will need to copy and paste into an email, fill it out, 
and then submit it via email to me. Now keep in mind for this, I do have a very specific email address that you need to use. It is not my normal email address and I won't be accepting any entries to that email address. Unfortunately, I need to keep this as streamlined as possible so that we can pick a winner as soon as possible. Showing on the screen now is what you will need to copy and paste into the body of your email to submit your entries via email. You will notice that it starts and stops with a line of asterisks. Make sure to copy and paste all of that. All of that top section is required. You need to fill out all five of those questions. And then just like before, you'll just fill in as many secret words as you have, whether that's one or 15. And then at the bottom, if you earned any bonus entries, write down which ones you earned. And again, I will verify that all of the requirements were met for you to receive those bonus entries. Once you have filled that in, you're going to send the email to craftyal10k at gmail.com. You will need to submit your entries, whether it is through the Google form or via email, no later than midnight on Sunday, May 31st. No late entries will be accepted. I will then be back sometime during that first week in June to announce the winners. Each of the winners will then have one week to claim their prize via the instructions I will give on the announcement video. If you have any questions on specifics for these instructions, please leave those in the comments section below. You might not be the only one with that question. I cannot wait to start seeing these entries roll in and to pick my four winners. Until my next video, I hope you're all having a crafty day. Bye-bye.